build on that the other night against BU when they had the incredible run to come back. I think this season's still going to have some peaks and valleys for this Drexel team because they're a very young team. But you don't know if this is the type of emotional win that can carry them for a longer period of time. If DeRocca shoots the ball like he did and they can get Lindemann back in the, in the lineup and back inside, then all of a sudden they become a team that you're definitely going to have to contend with come tournament time in America East. Once again, because of the fact that the standings are the way they are in the America East, and because everybody is so very tightly bunched up on top, you know, so far, as we have mentioned, Vermont has been the team that everybody's kind of been chasing this year, and that's going to be a tough team to knock off the top again. But, as Bill Herring alluded to on Thursday, there is a tournament. And as soon as you get into a tournament situation, you've got yourself an opportunity. And let's flash ahead as well with response to what it is that's going to happen. Realize that the Drexel Dragons will be moving it on and taking on St. Joseph's on Thursday. And then on Friday, Towson will be home to take on Maine. Drexel winning it by a point. For Rob Kennedy and our entire CNA crew, this is Scott Graham. We take you out with the game-winning foul shot from Mike Dorakis in an incredible Drexel victory.